This is Brad Dickin with the Illyria Chronicle Telegram, standing outside of the Southern Ohio Correctional Facility in Lucasville, Ohio. Just witnessed the execution of Daniel Wilson, who was tried and convicted for the 1991 murder of Carol Lutz, whom he locked in the trunk of her own car and set the car ablaze. Wilson was brought to this facility from death row at the Ohio State Penitentiary yesterday, arriving at 9.49 a.m. He was uh, prepared for death uh, this morning, and there was some difficulty establishing a shunt into his right arm, but the, the medical personnel and the execution team were able to do so, and he entered the cha death chamber at about 10.15, 10.16 a.m. Uh, he then made, gave a brief final statement apologizing to the Lutz family for uh, taking their daughter, as well as apologizing to his own family. He then said that he would, uh, was a Christian and that uh, he was coming home to Jesus. Uh, after that, uh, the drugs began to flow. Um, once the sedative had been administered, the warden uh, paused the process, shook Wilson um, by the arm, called his name, and a medical personnel from the execution team re-entered the chamber and checked to make sure that he was indeed unconscious and that the lines were still working to carry the lethal drugs to him. Uh, the drugs then um, were, began to flow again, and Wilson was ultimately pronounced dead at 10.33 a.m. This has been Brad Dickin with the Lyric Chronicle Telegram outside the Southern Ohio Correctional Facility in Lucasville, Ohio.